Jay Tan coming in here on behalf of AfterBuzz TV at the Hangar at the OC Fairgrounds in Costa Mesa, California. I'm here at the end of RFA 23 with RFA's own lightweight champion, Meji Baghdad. How you doing, Meji? I'm good, I'm good, thanks. This is a nice uh, return for you. Of course, just a couple months ago, you won your uh, uh, first RFA championship here at this, uh, at this venue, and uh, you're returning. Um, any, any flashbacks or nice memories you have having tonight? Yeah, a lot of good memory, and uh, I saw the guys in the cage. You have a really good fight tonight. I have my teammate team fight. I was, I was it's like me. I, I was fighting, you know, and I was liking the last fight, uh, Terry. Yeah, Terry and Ware great. and Joe Murphy. Uh, Joe Murphy, it was great, great fight. A lot of ambience, and I was, I was really excited. It's like me. I was fighting, so a lot of memory. Yeah. Um, tell me how things have been for you with the holidays since the title win. Uh, last time we spoke with you, I believe your girlfriend or uh, fiance was going to hook up some good French food, I believe. Yeah, my fiance makes really good, good food. I, I gained a little bit of weight. <laughs> I, I went in France to see my family because I live here in, uh, in LA. Uh -huh. So guys, just to, to make see my family, uh, enjoy, and come right. back and uh, training really hard. What part of France is your family living in? South France. South okay, France. not Grenoble, right? No, close to Saint Tropez. When I hear France, I immediately think Grenoble and Andre the Giant. Yeah, yeah it was nice there. Yeah. Nice. So let's talk about the future now. We're early into 2015. This is RFA's second show. Uh, you tentatively have some news on the uh, next match for you? So right, right now for two months, I was helping Anderson Silva. I was his training camp, what I told you last time. I was a great training camp. We went to Vegas. We won. Uh, right now, I'm training camp Lyoto Machida. It's more for image, if, if for promote myself, I stay with them, you know. So right now, I I wait for UFC to call me. So if you know UFC call me, I'm defending my belt April or, or May. April or May, you're looking to defend. Yeah, I'm I'm really training hard. Uh, I'm starting left weight. I never left weight in my life. Yeah, really? I, yeah, I'm weight I fighter. I, I, I'm soccer player, you know. I, I no more left, I never left weight, so I'm standing left weight three times a week. I'm going to be more more strong because my last fight, I was a little bit tired, and every time everybody told me you have to left weight, man. It's no MMA, it's not just strength west wrestling or and jiu jitsu and weight. I know, stand left weight. I said, right now I'm going to left weight. I'm going to be a, a MMA fighter right now. But it's just about uh, retoning your body. You'll stay at lightweight, yes? Yeah, I stay lightweight. Just be more more strong. Got it. Um, the matches tonight, of course, when you fought, uh, you won the title and there was a lot of talk. You know, each champion here, they're on that precipice to make the jump to the UFC. Um, that was a little bit kind of the, the storyline behind the main event, uh, Terry and Ware and Joe Murphy. Um, did you see, based, based on the match, uh, what you saw? Do you feel that they're ready to make that jump to the UFC as well? For me, the two guys ready for UFC because I, when I saw some fight in UFC, I don't think so. You have this place on UFC. I'm not going to say a lot of shit about them. We have some people don't have this place here. RFA and the main event is the best fighter are here in America and, and in the world. So Terry and Joe Murphy, I think you have this place for UFC for sure. Does that belt represent to you when you win the belt, the RFA title? Um, is it about being a champion for the RFA or is it? representative of the ticket to the next step up in your career? I think the two, the two, because RFA champion is a lot of things, because I was world champion Muay Thai, and for me, MMA champion is, is a lot, you know, so it's the two thing, a ticket for going UFC, and one uh, MMA world, uh, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. this is, was my, my goal. So right now, I'm training really hard, and I want this belt in UFC, that's it. Understood. Well. Hopefully, we'll, uh, you'll get the call very soon, or if not that, we'll see you defending your belt in April. Uh, tell us about your social media, where people can find you. You can find me in Facebook, Medi Baghdad, or Instagram, Medi Baghdad, The Sultan. So, or Twitter, I'm here, and answer so for all questions. And the spelling of the name is M-E-H-D-I... B-A-G-H-G-A-D. -E like Baghdad, like the city. Yeah. All one word together. Yeah. There you go, guys. At the end of RFA 23, J-Tan for AfterBuzz, Meji Baghdad for the RFA. We'll see you next time.